Yeah, I was doing fine. Started fresh out here in the West for two years. Barely ever on my mind. Till a friend called up telling me that you gon' move here. Oh. What is up YouTube and welcome back to the channel. Uh, I'm a bit sleepy today. I uh, had a very, very late night last night. Uh, finished streaming at 4 o'clock in the morning uh, and I've been up since 9 so if I sound a little bit out of it, I do apologise. But I wanted to bring you the review of the uh, the Oculus FPS gaming glasses. I believe they're still going to be called Oculus. They had to change their name because uh, somebody, some company on Facebook was going to sue them for something. I don't know. Uh, but that's beside the point. But these are badged up as Oculus, as you can see on the little box that they come in. Hard case that they come with, which is nice. And you get a microfiber cleaning cloth with them, which is always good. So I've been using these for, I don't know, five days now. Uh, for long periods of time, five, six hours of gaming. Um, so I'm going to give you my honest opinion about them and let you know what I think. Uh, I'll run you through a few of the specs about what the glasses are. Uh, so you know what you're getting into or what I'm talking about. Uh, so they are gaming glasses, essentially. Um, they're CE and FDA approved. Um, the frame material is all stainless steel, so they're good and sturdy. Uh, lens size, if you need to know, is uh, lens length 54 mils, lens height 35 mils, bridge length 17 mils, and arm length 138 mils. Um, the lens type is a CR39 which I believe is a toughened type of lens. Uh, it says here, very durable and scratch resistant. Uh, I'm not that into glasses because I don't wear glasses. I do have a pair of glasses that I should wear, but I don't. Uh, and that kind of leads me into this. Um, oh, actually, I've missed out a bit there. They block roughly 45% of blue light and 100% of UV light. Uh, so they're also great for outdoors. And we're going to talk about that. That's the specs. I never really read the specs, but it's quite important these things. So, I was a bit apprehensive about these... Uh, when I was uh, asked if I wanted to be sponsored and we were talking about it. Because I see a lot of these gaming glasses and I think, oh God, they just look ridiculous. They look like you're wearing a big pair of fishing glasses. I used to go fishing with my dad when I was a kid uh, and he had the uh, the special glasses that made you see through the surface of the water so you could see fish and stuff like that. And they were big ugly things with bright yellow lenses in. And I kind of always got that feel about it from gaming glasses, seeing other companies out there, you all know who they are. So I was like, oh, do I really want these things? But I thought, okay, I'll give them the benefit of the doubt. And I had a look through the website and they looked all right. The lenses looked like normal glasses. So I thought, okay, fine. So they sent me out and i kind of forgotten about it until they arrived. Uh, and lo and behold, I had these glasses here. Put them on and thought, yeah, okay. They feel like actually normal glasses. They don't look like anything ridiculous. I mean, you could wear these outside happily and people would just think you've got a slight tint in your lens uh, and they're not anything to do with gaming. Uh, and because they block the UV light, probably going to do that because I live in Spain, I've got a lot of sunshine, I'm constantly getting headaches during the summer because it's so bright, so I might try these out. But we're focusing on the gaming, I'm rambling, this is what I do when I'm tired, I ramble on and talk rubbish about other stuff. Take a breath and relax. So, I have put in, let's think, I've done about five, six plus hour streams, I streamed last night, I played during the day, so I've racked up some gameplay with them. And what I found with these, apart from the fact that they do improve what you're looking at, which we'll talk about in a second, Every single time I had them on, I forgot I was wearing them. Now, for someone that doesn't wear glasses very often, I think that says a lot about these. That they're comfortable, they're lightweight, and they must be working and doing something. If you were to wear something that would affect your eyesight, you would realise you're doing it after a certain amount of time. You'd want to take them off. You'd start getting eye strain, you'd start getting a headache, you'd feel uncomfortable. But nothing like that ever happened, uh, and I thought that was quite good. Visually, on the screen... I use a BenQ Pro Gaming screen. I can't remember the name of it. So visually, it's very accurate. Uh, it's a fucking proper gaming screen. One millisecond, one millisecond response time and all that good stuff. And the PS4 looks amazing on it. With these, edge detail is improved a lot, which I was quite surprised about. Uh, these aren't a prescription lens, so they're not affecting my eyesight at all. They're just clearing stuff up. I don't know how it works, science and magic and wizardry. Uh, but it does. Edge details, like I said, are much better. Colours are a lot more vibrant. I haven't changed any settings on the screen, but it looks like the settings have been changed. It looks like there's a lot more punch to everything. Probably due to the yellow tint and the fact it's blocking out blue light and it somehow registers with your eyes that it's making things look brighter and clearer. So from that aspect of it, the fact that I could wear them for six hours, not realise I was wearing them, not get headaches at all, uh, and not feel ice cream. I mean, I... I did a 14-hour work shift yesterday, came home, streamed for four and a half hours, 
and had these on the whole time and didn't have sore eyes being bit. I was knackered, but that's because of the work. But if I did that normally without these on, I'm pretty sure my eyes would be like, oh, I've got to go to bed. But they weren't. So I honestly, honestly think that these may actually do something for gamers. Um, so I, I give them a thumbs up. I'm going to keep wearing them. I'm quite happy to be on board with the company. I think they'll do good things. Um, so if you want to check them out for yourself, there'll be a link in the description. If you want to purchase some, I'm not pushing you into anything. You know here on the channel, I won't push you into anything at all. Uh, I do have a code for you guys to use so you can get a discount. It's code TYE, T -Y -E, like all my sponsorships. Um, so yeah, give them a go. See what you think. If you're looking for a pair of gaming glasses that don't look like gaming glasses, these are the ones. Um, they're awesome. Really solid, really good. Thumbs up from me. Peace!